There's a new world of fruit fingering on Instagram, <laughs> and it's fun. doing really, really well. Stephanie Sarley is the artist behind fruit fingering. Artist. And yes, it is a female. And no, you don't see her face or any body parts other than her fingers in these videos. But nonetheless, her Instagram has racked up more than 61,000 followers. And each of her videos garner well over 1,000 favorites and hundreds of comments from fans and trolls alike. Now, I want to give her proper credit because she's having a huge problem with people copywriting uh, or co doing copyright infringement of her work. Again, this is Stephanie Sarley. This is her work. I want to give her credit. But with that said, take a look at the video and understand what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Oh, do it. But so. Oh, rub that. Yeah. You know, Cubans refer to uh, vagina as papaya. So this is this is perfect. Oh, my God. Go to it, champ. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah. So, there you go, baby. There you go. So here's the, look, there's so many amazing components to this story, but I just want to let you know that her Instagram page was actually disabled three times. For what, being obscene with fruit? <laughs> I don't know. For, I don't know. For, uh, we have a fruit violation here. You have violated that fruit far too much with your fingers. But here's the thing. With all social media, people can flag your content. I'm guessing someone had flagged her and thought that, you know, this was too explicit for, for Instagram. I don't know. I feel like Instagram is too prudish for my taste. <laughs> Even though I still love it and I still post pictures on it. But still. Um, and she talks about how she really loves... Um, Meyer lemons. Meyer lemon squirt is my absolute favorite. Oh, it yeah. was unexpected when the juice hit the camera. Okay. <laughs> no, but when I first saw this story, I thought that it had to do with oh. those like ASMR <laughs> videos, right? You know how people are into like weird, not, I don't want to call it weird, but some people find it relaxing or something. So I'm like, yeah. oh, maybe that's what it is. But no, she's straight out saying like, this is sexual in nature. Like this is, look at that. Yeah. Oh, is it? I couldn't tell if that was sexual in nature. There you go, baby. There you go. Oh, yeah. <laughs> okay. So, look, look. She says it's art, and we've given her all the credit in the world here for art. But keep it real. That's not why people are watching it, okay? They're watching it because they're into it. I don't know if she, like, single-handedly invented the fetish. If she did, I'll give her even more yeah. credit for that, right? Uh, but obviously some people are into it and it does it looks funny right yeah. at a minimum it's funny and but like is that really all it takes for some guys to jerk off like that's what I want to know and it's fine it's healthy I've talked about it before I want you to pleasure yourself I think it's an important part of life but but it's incredible what some people get turned on by because yeah. I watch that and I'm I see the artistic component to it to some extent. Like I'm curious to see what a fruit, how a fruit responds to you fingering it. I never thought about it before, and I like different perspectives on I'm life. I'm pretty sure it doesn't have much of a response. It has to sit there and take it. Look, I didn't know. <laughs> I didn't know that a Meyer lemon squirts. Um, she also says that uh, I tried fingering a regular lemon, and it just didn't do the same thing. I didn't know that. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, because it's too <laughs> stiff, ironic. Yeah, and she'd like to finger a pineapple. Oh, I see. The pineapple is too, too stiff. stiff. Which makes sense, right? Yeah. Pineapple, no fun. Mm -hmm. um, but she also has that artist perspective where she's like, I don't know. It's up for interpretation. At least that's the sense I get based on interviews mm -hmm. she's done. She had a great interview with The Daily Dot that you guys should check out. So Yeah. Look, uh, there's... Uh, a very good chance that guys are into it and I mean look a anybody who looks at that knows that it's sexual right uh, but there might be some chance that it might be women who are into it mm. okay because like for some uh, we did the story last week of the uh, erotic banana eating that was banned in China and <laughs> yes. like this or they're like smearing it all over <coughs> their face and taking it in the ear and stuff so that's <laughs> obvious that the guys want that okay, they want yeah, to see. but mean, in this case it seems like you know she's rubbing the you know and then the, it almost looks like female squirting, okay, right? Okay, yes. So it might be like, I pop paya. You're so cheesy. <laughs> I can't take it. But anyway. I know, I'm banana. But, you know, the one thing that it taught me, I got that, I got that. Uh, the one thing that it taught me, I I enjoy the company of men, right? So I, Good for you. I've never... I've never been curious about women in a sexual capacity, but 
it's interesting because as I watch that, I'm like, man, women really know how to pleasure a vagina, right? Oh. And, so, and I'm not saying like, or oh my God, is there a woman out there who's gonna pleasure my vagina? No, that's not what I'm saying. But it's just interesting because women know what they're doing because they have vaginas themselves, which leads me to believe that lesbian sex is awesome. Orange, you curious? <laughs> She's just like, she's perfectly Come on, gentle. that was good. I stretched for that, but that was pretty good. But by the way, with the same logic, you could just say the same thing for guys. Like, guys have a lot of experience pleasuring penises. Yeah, exactly. Their so own, I, So I'm, right? I'm guessing gay sex is probably phenomenal. I mean, to each his own. To each his own, yes. But, you but know one thing saying. we can all agree on is fruit sex rocks. <laughs> one other um, comment from her that I think is great. I didn't invent fingering fruit. It's a natural thing to, to finger things, to play with your food, but what I invented was a compelling video that meant something to people about menstruation and virginity and sex and love. It meant so many different things. Some people thought I was a man, some people thought I was a woman, some people were offended. It just went on. I don't know, I just like that, that yeah. statement from her. No, we live in a brave new world, but not in a bad way. Like, okay, everybody's having fun. Yeah. I mean, some people are not having fun and they're doing disastrous things, but meanwhile, we've got this, and this I could live with. Yes, <laughs> okay. I like it. Make it squirt.